welcome to C3 Kids Church Online. My name is Izzy and it is great that you are joining us today. Special shout out if you are new and joining us for the first time. Now let's get ready to sing. This song is how we put our trust in God. No matter what I'm gonna face, gonna face tomorrow, I build my life on everything you say. Turn the light on, now I see, now I see forever The path is clearer out in front of me I put one foot in front of the other Keeping my eyes on you My life following Jesus I trust you, I trust you As the world shakes, shakes and things break, break You are my rock, my everything as the world shakes, shakes, and things break, break You are my rock, my everything hey. No matter what I'm gonna face, gonna face tomorrow I build my life on everything you say You turn the light on, now I see, now I see forever the path is clearer out in front of me I put one foot in front of the other Keeping my eyes on you My life following Jesus I trust you I trust you As the world shakes, shakes and things break, break You are my rock, my everything As the world shakes, shakes and things break, break you are my rock, my everything. As the world shakes and things break, as the world shakes and things As the world shakes, shakes, and things break, break You are my rock, my everything As the world shakes, shakes, and things break, break You are my rock, my everything As the world shakes, shakes, and things break, break You are my rock, my everything As the world shakes, shakes, and things break, break You are my rock, my everything Woo! This song is called Fight My Battles how we can remember that we can fight through any difficult situation with God on our side. Are you ready? Let's sing together. This is how I fight my battles. 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 This is how I fight Hi, my name is George and I'm going to be talking about why the Bible says it's important to rest. Life gets really, really busy, doesn't it? There's always something to do 
something to learn, friends to hang out with, chores to do, schoolwork, the list goes on and on and on. But the Bible says in Exodus 20, verse 8 to 11, for us to rest, remember the Sabbath day, to keep it holy. The Bible is telling us that we need to have a holy day on the Sabbath. If you keep reading, it tells us what the Sabbath means. Six days you do work, but the, sa- but the seventh day is the Sabbath of the Lord. So it's the seventh day of the week. That's usually Sunday. But the Bible tells us you shouldn't do any work, but to keep it a special day for God. Remember, even God had a rest on Sunday when he was creating the world. The Bible tells us so. God blessed one day of the week and called it holy. It means that he set it apart from the other days for a really important purpose. You might be thinking, but what if your, my grown-ups work in places like hospitals or shops that open on a s- Sunday? How can they do what God wants if they have to work? If some people do have to work on a Sunday, they can pick a different day in the week to honour God. And that's the important bit, to spend time with God. The reason the Sabbath is different to any to other days is because it's the day to honour God and spend time appreciating everything that he has done for us. When we take this time to think and open our hearts to thank God, it will bring us rest and help us when things get tough. So God tells us, take time to stop, rest and focus on him. Chilling with God, now that's a good thing to do. Now we've got a prayer with Izzy. Thank you, George, for those encouraging words. Now let's pray. Dear God, thank you for creating heaven and the earth in six days and showing us that we need to rest from our busy lives. Help us to know when to rest and live each day with your strength. Help us to take the time to thank you for everything you do for us. Amen. Ladies and gentlemen, to the most amazing show on earth, we have dancing elephants, amazing strongmen, trapeze artists, and the amazing Anna. Anna, Anna, wake up, Anna. I'm, just, I'm still performing. Okay. Oh. oh, I must have been asleep. Performing? Yeah, well, I just had this dream that I was a dancer in the circus and oh, it just felt so real, I felt so alive. Well, that's a bit random. <laughs> well, not really. I mean, I've always wanted to be a dancer, actually. Maybe it's a dream from God. You know, like Joseph and those people. Maybe that's what you meant to do. Well, I would love to. Why are you looking at me like that? Well, in my dream, you were a showman. And uh, it just felt so real. I mean, it kind of feels weird that you're not now. Showman. This is the greatest show! Whoa, whoa, oh. maybe. Maybe not, actually. Oh, okay. Awkward. Um, you know, may- maybe God will give you one of those dreams as well. <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> Thanks for joining us today at C3 Kids Church Online. Don't forget that all kids in school years 1-6 to are invited to join kids live groups every Tuesday night at 5.30 on Zoom. Tell your grown-ups to email kids at the c3.uk to sign up. And, uh, And of course, don't forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit that notification bell so you don't miss anything. See you next time. Bye! Light up every moment, make my every dream come true.